Australia's deadly arsenal donations arrive in Ukraine to fight against Russia. Ukraine's President Volodymyr Zelensky has expressed his gratitude to Australian Prime Minister Scott Morrison for the country's deadly help, which has arrived in Ukraine. Australia's Defence Minister Peter Dutton confirmed to ABC's insiders that deadly assistance had come, but he would to reveal what shape it had taken. Last week, Prime Minister Scott Morrison announced Australia will provide $70 million in deadly and non-lethal military help, which would include missiles and ammo. In a phone chat with Prime Minister Morrison, President Zelensky expressed his gratitude for Australia's military and humanitarian aid. Mr Zelensky thanked Australia for its assistance, according to an official transcript of the phone conversation, while Mr Morrison informed him that Australia stands with Ukraine in its fight against Russia's aggression and unjustified attack. In the name of all Australians, the Prime Minister applauded Ukraine's bravery and denounced Russia's actions. Furthermore, Australia is supporting UN resolutions and actions by the International Criminal Court in support of the Ukrainian people and government. Senator James Patterson, a Liberal from Ontario, is now in the United States on an official tour, where he was briefed at the White House and the UN. As a result of the world's amazing solidarity in reaction to Russia and President Putin, he expresses cautious hope. Labour Party defence spokesperson Brendan O'Connor said on the show that Australia has done right by engaging in denunciation and action, including deadly and non-lethal assistance to Ukraine. O'Connor was speaking on behalf of the Australian government.